just to make it easy on you, what would you do for all the video game stuff? Oh, that would be great. Um, what is up, you guys? It is a Wednesday morning here at my local flea market. Not too many people here, but let's get out here and see if we can still find some deals. What's up, buddy? Hey, what's up, man? How are you? Good, good. We're still in all of that ping driver, man. Was that a G2? G5. G5 five wood, worth like 60 bucks or so. Yep. Twenty-five for the stack. No, no, the shoes. The shoes. Right oh, there. okay. The shoes on this side are ten. Those over there are twenty-five. That's that car is too much. Yeah. 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 And it's uh, four seven. All right, so yeah, I get the Wii cords. Always need those. Um, what are you doing these dongles? Dollar each on this? Okay. That's two, that's five. Okay. Are you putting out more stuff? Or is this? Okay. I got a bag of I got mine down here. Thanks, man. I appreciate you. This year's two dollars a piece. Some of them are a little bit cleaner than others, but but that's what you get with hats from the '90s. They bounced around. Did you take ten bucks for the whole box? How many of them? I think thirteen. One, two, three, four. No, four, five, six, seven, eight. nine. Nine. I don't know why it's thirteen. I do twelve for the whole box. I'll I'll do twelve. There you go. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Oh Alright, so, so you came here today. <laughs> yeah. I'm here. Uh, so I came to this nice booth and uh this uh this couple here uh, they're called Storage Chasers on YouTube and they uh got some good stuff here and they recognize me from YouTube. So I'll go uh, check out their channel later uh -huh. on. But thank you guys so much. It was I nice meeting you. Savannah, Georgia, yeah. for vacation. We watched that show. Like, yep. the, oh, they yeah, we're trying to travel all over the place. Uh, yes, is it a vacation or a work day? I know you guys go shopping. Yeah, a little, like, <laughs> little bit of both. A little bit of both. Harry, Harry, I gotta give you this. I grew this. What is it? Acorn squash. Acorn squash. This is a buttercup squash. Okay. It's a buttery and smoothie. Buttery and smoothie, okay. Uh, I want to give you one. No chemicals. We don't spray any chemicals. It's delicious. I will take it if you want to give it to me. That, there's my lunch for today. How do you cook it? You can roast it in the oven. Okay. It's better than boiling or steaming, so it doesn't lose flavor okay. by water. Yeah. Uh, cinnamon, nutmeg, cinnamon and nutmeg? Okay. brown sugars, awesome. however you want to eat it. They're sweet well, thank and Thank you so much. Yeah, I appreciate that. Well, it was good to meet you guys. You too. Very nice to meet yeah, you. Yeah, absolutely. Your wife's not here. <laughs> no, she, uh, she got back late last night, so she's still sleeping this morning. Couldn't talk her into coming. Yeah, that's another good day. <laughs> yeah, not too hot. It's beautiful. Uh, I, I asked for overcast cool weather. And you got it. Uh -huh. That's right. Awesome. Well, thank you guys so much. I appreciate it. Yeah, thank you. you light up my day. <laughs> you light up my day. <laughs> Is this your table? How much are you asking for that one? Five. <laughs> I'll take a chance on that one. For five. Right, I'll just throw it in here. I appreciate it. Thank you. Just take a dollar for your little tapes. I would if it was mine, but I saw oh. oh. <laughs> Who's. Y'all sound different today. <laughs> well, I told him I gotta be against the sun. <laughs> right. Well, I'm already there too. I'm already there too. I'm already there too. Right. Don't think that. No, this is what this guy. No, right. Yeah, this guy. And this gentleman was born. Had a question. Yeah. 
flying through these islands. Oh, about the game? And then shot the cat out of the car and shot it in the head. And then you hold the trailer back. Yeah. Um, so I was asking about these little tapes over here. Um, but then I saw all your video games, <laughs> so I might just okay. uh, do a little bundle deal. Okay. Um, that, yeah, that's a lot cheaper for me. Yeah. Well, for you. Get it, yeah, for both of us. Get them out of your way. Um, <laughs> There's a couple. I don't know if they're in there, but it says Xbox on there. Thing. You can yeah. check to see if they're in there. You can make it part of your bundle deal. All right. Thank you. Oh, check what I found out. Found under the roof. Manual ran, no battery, you ain't got a charge. <laughs> you work up the sweat while you do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was telling him a good arm and hand workout. Yeah. yeah. It, does feel good, though. it does feel good. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's what they did back in the olden days before, okay. before AC. Uh, yeah, sometimes the titles are different, but so far everything's been in there. Different one. Let's set that down for a second. Oh, oh my gosh, I didn't. I break it, I buy it, right? Yeah. If I see you, I can tell it was an Thank you. I don't Unless it was something like really expensive that I was going to make our day. Yeah. <laughs> Other than that, I don't. Not me. <laughs> How much is it? How much is a picture and how much is a oh, hand? Cool. Um, hmm, about. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I want to say like a four? What you think, three maybe? How about four? Okay, <laughs> we'll do that. <laughs> I'll take five. <laughs> well, no, don't get carried away. <laughs> okay. Um, just to make it easy on you, what would you do for all the video game stuff? Oh, that would be great. Um, Some of the controllers may not work. I don't know. I just feel like it would be easy for both of us if I just do everything in a big bundle. And then these as well? Yeah. Okay. Oh, you got more stuff over here? Yeah. Yeah, yeah just collect it all up. Let's... I think that's everything. I want to say, um... Excuse me. I'm about to tell him. I don't hear what I'm about to tell him. So. <laughs> he'll, he'll, he'll say no. Yeah, those are all games right there, too. <laughs> we know. We're yeah. Let yeah. me figure this out here. Yes. Come on, spray. I want to say 50 60 for everything. No less than 60. Well, we can take a picture. Make it easier. Depending on, you know. Yes. I got two. I'll tell you what. I'm gonna feel bad if I give you 60. So how about 80 bucks for everything? Perfect. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah, great. I, I'll, I'll, I'll pay <laughs> as, you. absolutely. That's a lot of customers you want. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, I like a deal, but I don't wanna. Cause I wanted to say 50, 60. Oh, yeah. I, I appreciate it, I appreciate it. You got a 20 if I pay with that? Sure do. Okay. I think you got a little camera in there. Yeah. I'm sure some of it doesn't work, but hopefully Look, enough of it. Check these out. These have oh, been real and just smashed. Wow, that's awesome. I checked them. So now y'all got room on the table for more stuff. Yeah, we'll that, that too. Yeah. I'll put some of this stuff in my bag down here. Thank you. How Thank cool. you. Thanks. Absolutely. Yeah, I love I love yes. bulk deals like that. Yes. Yeah, so and I just got to make it back to the car. <laughs> and we love customers like you. <laughs> Thank you. I, 
Sumatra. I don't want to make no enemies out here because y'all oh, probably no, come out here again in the future and then hopefully you remember me. Yeah. 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 I'm always looking for video games or like VCRs, DVD combo units, well, stuff check like us that. Because we just got rid of an ass of that. Yeah. yeah I'm and always some of buying. them were worth two, three hundred dollars, and he yeah. sold all four pieces for like man, each. Yeah. Now, and he sold all four pieces for fifty bucks. Wow. Well, it was um, studio recording equipment, like a synthesizer. Yeah. See, yeah. one of them was like any kind of cool electronics like that. I'm always looking for this. Okay, well, cool. unbiased. We try to hit here every day. Sometimes he'll come on the weekend without me. Yeah. So if you see him running around, you know, then. Okay. But, cool. Um, but yeah, definitely every Wednesday because we hit auctions up. Stuff, okay. So. Awesome. Thank y'all so much. Yes. Thank you. <sighs> These are 40. That's a newer set that just came out. And that one's actually. I don't know what those retail for, but this a kid brought in with his basketball and uh, jersey collection. I know what these retail for. Those yeah. are $106 on average. Yeah, I bet. It's Jordan's. Huh? Seven. This is unlocking some memories for me, man. Yeah. I used to are, watch this show all the time. Those are two bucks a piece, Josh. Two bucks a piece? Yeah. These, whatever this tag is, man, for you, just cut it in half. If it makes a weird number, like these would be five bucks a piece, mm -hmm. these would be 20 bucks a piece. How much for the loose, dirty Wii console? Five bucks. Wii is called a uh, PlayStation Move. Mm -hmm. It works with the uh, VR games. I'm hoping that they work because I got a customer that needs them and doesn't want to pay sixty bucks at GameStop. Yeah. So that is Mad Eyed Moody's wand from the Universal Studios theme park. That's pretty cool. It's not the good one. It's not the one that has a sensor in it. That is the okay one. That is the collector's nice heavy one. Yeah. And it's got um, dex de desiccant bags as well as a mold bag. You <laughs> got to turn the head till it fits right in the spot. Oh. Inside there the bottom of the box to keep mold and water out. Mm -hmm. But it's not the one that you can go to the park and do that little wave of your motion and stuff happens. Yeah. Fun. All right, man. I'm going to get all the systems. Okay. All okay. the, and all this, all this stuff right here. Okay. So you said five each on these, 10 on that. Five, 10, 10. What'd you say, like two bucks a piece on these? Let me see what we got. We got 5, 10, 15. That's 20. 30. You want the fig pins too? No, just just, uh, just the Xena and stuff okay. on top. How about 40 bucks for all of it? If you want the fig pins, I'll do 60 bucks for the fig pins included. I mean, I'll, I'll try them. It's new, it's new, new items. They're easy to list. I don't know anything about them, but... Hand me the wand real quick. Let's get that back the way it's supposed to be because it's actually... It's brand new, apparently. Mm -hmm. You got changed for a hundred. Yeah. Okay. So I was at Target. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Or Walmart, or I just bought um, that. Target or Walmart or wherever buying mm -hmm. new toys. I think my camera shut off because I was at that booth for so long. But I brought uh, basically that first lot of video game stuff back to the car, and I got to go back to buy to grab all the stuff that I bought from that other guy. Or squirrels. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, man. Yeah, buddy. All right. Yeah, I appreciate you. Yeah, man. Yeah. They're, kind of, they're different. Hey, get you some slides, what, people are going to be mad if yeah. I don't ask you what you're wanting for the Jordans. $20. Yeah. $20? I don't deal with shoes, bro. I just get my money back out of what I paid for. They bring me all kinds of stuff. <laughs> Tell you what, I'll give you $20 before this guy makes a move. <laughs> yeah, I'll show him how to get him. But you ask him up, bro. I appreciate that. There was some craziness out here last weekend, apparently. Yeah, shoot. yeah I saw somebody got arrested or something. The guy was on his shoot because Shooting? of a parking spot. That's somebody crazy. Beat to, but somebody beat him to a parking speed. They yeah. got out the and car. He pulled out a gun. gun. Like last Wednesday. Yeah, he yeah. started shooting. I was That's here last Wednesday. Saturday. I must have left before. Now, something happened. Yeah. I didn't know there was a gun Wednesday, but the same thing happened. But I heard there was a gun here. They shut the place down for a few minutes. Yeah. Didn't let anybody come or go. That was just right. Never parked. Was that lot. Saturday or Sunday? That was Saturday. Let's just say the flea market apparently is getting serious now. Yeah. And about six girls was fighting on the far end a couple of Saturdays ago. They had it on somebody put on Facebook. I said, that's crazy, man. That's why I don't come out here. I got to catch some of that on my on say, my camera. That do. would be a good video if I Fight called that on camera. Fights at the flea market. Yeah. All right, man. I appreciate the deal. Have a great one, buddy. You too, man. Uh, All right, gonna go put this stuff in the car because I'm dumb and I didn't bring another empty IKEA bag with me. Uh, and then we'll grab an IKEA bag. And I think there's one or two more rows here at the flea market we can look at. Oh, okay. oh they are.
Those are cool. Oh, I probably look at the different. I could look them up. These are ones you're looking up? Huh? These are the ones you're looking up? Uh -huh. Or these are. Okay. Yeah. She, she, five. Yeah. I've never seen anything like this. She said 70 on those, 60 on those. Uh -huh. And you don't know on those. 100, mm -hmm. 100 on those. Okay. Yeah, All right. Are. I'll think about it. Yeah, they are. Yeah, they look. Okay. Thank you. What's up, Town Native? Hey, what's up, man? How are you? I've been watching you. I appreciate that. You find anything good this morning? I actually bought Christmas stuff. Christmas stuff. Yeah. Now, now's the time of year. You bunch can buy it Santa, cheap now. Battery operator. Hey, man, I've I've sold some expensive. There's like Jingle Jingle Bell Rock and all that stuff. Yeah, that stuff I, sells good. I, I bought a box in three bags. There you go. Can't beat that. Just no. stick it in the stick in the attic for a couple yeah. more months and then triple your money. There you go. Is this your booth here? Or, yes, sir. Okay. I got some cool stuff. Just asking for the Harley boots. I had 15 a pair, but I do 10 a pair. 10 a pair. Hmm. It's not a bad price. They just need a little bit of cleaning, and I'm tired of cleaning shoes, man. I've been cleaning shoes for a month now, but I appreciate the deal, though. Thanks, man. It was good meeting you. What was your name? Junior. Junior? All right, Junior. I'll, I'll be on the lookout for you next week. <laughs> I'm bad. You feel it? Oh, I'm bad. Is this, is this your table? It is. How much are you asking for this little camera? Uh, oh, well, that's in 20. Best, mm. What's the best you'll do? Well, I don't know if it works. I don't really know anything, but I just like the way it looks. It, sometimes mm. it depends. I did have somebody. I, actually, I should have gone with a 20 and somebody offered me <laughs> the other day. Yeah. But that doesn't go live here. All right. Thank you. Appreciate it. So another fantastic morning here at the flea market. I'm telling you guys, this is quickly becoming my favorite way to source inventory. I mean, we picked up all this stuff. I don't remember exactly how much we spent, like probably like 200 bucks or so. I mean, just these Jordans, like shout out to that guy. I need to get the name of his, uh, he's, he owns like a used video game store in the area. Um, and he just really, just really gave us some good deals and all this stuff. I mean, I think I think the first spot was was 60 and then 20 for these was 80 bucks for everything we picked up at his booth um all the xena figure i mean just crazy stuff i'm gonna head home show all this stuff to Haley, and maybe cook some of that squash for lunch that um that, that, that those nice people gave me for free i've never had any of this the acorn squash or the butternut squash so maybe maybe i'll like it so i'm home i brought everything inside and i have the three wii's that we picked up today so i'm gonna plug them in and see if there's any games inside usually there is but never know don't think there's any in that one. Nothing in that one either. Oh, oh, what is this? Dance Dance Revolution. Uh, not a very good one, I don't think. But at least there's game inside. Cool. All right, so here is the flea market haul from this morning. Everything but that bag right there. Everything on the floor right here. The first thing we found, I think, is this box of Goodwrench hats. These are all pretty cool looking some of them are obviously more dirty than others um i think he was originally asking like two bucks a piece and uh, i think there were nine nine or ten total i like the pink ones and, and uh, purple ones better than the rest but i mean these are 1992 1995 um 1996 this is uh kind of like bread and butter stuff i'm assuming i tried to find some sold comps on ebay um i just searched vintage good wrench hat pink uh, and this one sold comp 25 bucks free shipping best offer accepted though so i don't know how much it actually sold for and that one looks pretty clean too so i don't know we paid 12 dollars for the whole box um i mean i might can sell them in bulk to somebody that wants to you know put the time into cleaning each one individually um i imagine each one as long as it's clean could sell for at least 10 to 15 bucks plus shipping i, I would think even even if it's just 10 dollars plus shipping um i mean there's i think nine hats total so that's like 80 90 bucks in profit uh as long as they come clean i believe the next find at the flea market was this huge box of video game stuff all those games earlier i showed you the titles i haven't looked up soul comps on everything but there looked to be a couple games that may have been pretty good if you guys saw something earlier let me know in the comments down below if you saw a good title but I, I was just going through everything on their table and it was just like good solid stuff i mean everything's a little rough and dirty but this um i think this is a ps3 camera i mean that's probably 15 bucks if it works i mean there's some wii charging cables wii sensor bars i mean there's probably 
10 PS2 or PS3 controllers, wherever these are. I think these are PS3 controllers. Um, a bunch of like, so oh, that's an HP printer cord there. I saw a bunch of Sony cords earlier. Um, Sony cords do well. Some more Wii controllers, some games. So I just threw out an offer. I was like, hey, how much for, for everything? Because I'm not going to try to go through and just pick stuff out of the pile. So uh, they offered 50 to 60, but there were two Wiis in that pile as well. We got everything in here, all those games, and two of those Wiis, and they wanted like 50 to 60 bucks for everything. I'm like, ah, I'll, I'll give you 80. Because even if some of that stuff doesn't work, I mean, I'll be able to make almost $80 back just with the Wiis because we both of them work. Um, there's one game in one of them. I showed you guys earlier. That game's not worth much, but... Uh, I felt like that was a, a pretty good price, especially to clear out the whole table. In terms of profit on that box, honestly, I have no idea. I mean, like I said, a lot of the stuff probably doesn't work. Some of the um, some of the controllers are missing, like the thumb caps on the joysticks. Um, but I don't know. I mean, there's definitely profit here. It's just hard to to say exactly what it'll be. A lot of the stuff I could probably just keep, you know, Wii cords and and all that stuff that I'll eventually use later on down the road. But either way, it was a good buy. Then moving on to the second video game and, and cool stuff haul from the second guy. I uh, picked up these Xena Warrior Princess action figures for two bucks a piece. I used to watch the show all the time. I don't know how popular it is now. I mean, these are just cool. Um, I imagine they're probably worth like, I don't know, 15, 20 bucks a piece maybe. Uh, I just, a little, little damage, like a little box damage, but I thought they were too cool to leave behind for two bucks. Picked up three consoles from that guy. We got the Sega Genesis 16-bit. I think there's one cord for it in that thing over there, but we're missing the controllers. Got a PS1 console only and a Nintendo Wii console only. Um, then, <laughs> that guy was getting out really good deals. I don't know what was up, but got this Radica, sealed Radica Solitaire. Um, paid 10 bucks for this. Well, he gave me a deal on everything. So, uh, this, since it's sealed, I should be able to get about 40 to $45 plus shipping for this on eBay. Always look out for sealed Radica games. Radica, it doesn't even have to be sealed. I mean, some of these used will sell for 30 to $50, but this particular model, Radica, will sell for about 40 $45 plus shipping on eBay. I also grabbed this Craig micro cassette recorder from that guy. I, anytime I find sealed micro cassette recorders, I get excited, but this one's not quite as good as I was hoping. Um, definitely be on the lookout for Sony or anything like that. Panasonic, but Craig is, I guess, maybe not as good of a brand. Uh, even sealed condition, this will still only sell for about $30 or so, um, but it does have tapes with it, so maybe I can get like 35 to 40. These fig pins that he like threw in on the deal, I really wasn't interested in them because he was asking you know, $50 for that one, $30 for that one, 15, 15, and 15. And then at the end, he's just like, I'll throw in all of them for 60 bucks. I'm like, uh, okay, I mean, I'll, I'll take them. The sell through rate on these is not very good. I think, like, especially like this one, um, which I think is the coolest one, Nightmare Before Christmas, I think there's four or five listed and none sold. But the ones that are listed are listed for like 80 to $100. I mean, it's crazy. So I don't know. I mean, these are all new in the box, easy to list, easy to ship. So we'll get them listed, just see what happens. It may take a while to sell, but I mean, we basically, have very little money into these uh, so I'm okay with sitting on them for a while we also went back and got this pair of kids Jordans from that guy they're I mean like new condition look like they were barely worn uh, and they have the original box with them as well these are a small size for youth um, he was saying that they sell for like 150 bucks but it looks like sold comps on eBay for this model uh, are right around 40 to 50 plus shipping but I think if since we have the box, we may be able to get a little bit more. I paid 20 bucks for these on the second go round, uh, so maybe we can try to get 60 to 70 plus shipping. At the last table of the day, my guy that I've bought something from every single time I went to the flea market, I got three of these rock band dongles from him. I kind of feel bad. I knew they were going to be good, uh, but I didn't know they were going to be quite this good. He only charged me a dollar each for these. I got three dongles and two Wii cords for five bucks, which is a crazy deal. I'm definitely going to have to pay a pay up for an item from him next time I go, but. Uh, just in case you guys didn't know, these Rock Band don dongles sell very well. I mean, 25 bucks plus shipping, 24 free shipping, 19 plus shipping, 22 free shipping, 28 free shipping. Uh, I mean, and we got three for a for dollar each. So as long as they all work, uh, we'll get these sold and should make about uh, 50, 60 bucks or so after fees just on those three. So again, a fantastic morning at the flea market as always. I mean, I'm telling you guys, the flea market has quickly become my favorite way to source new inventory. It's, you, you know, sometimes you pay up for some stuff, but I'm totally fine with paying up for items that are so consolidated. Like I went this morning, I did like two or three rounds around the entire flea market and it only took me, 
an hour and a half and I got all this stuff. I mean, it's it's been very, very fruitful for me and I'm definitely gonna keep doing it into the future. Of course, we need to get all this stuff fully tested and make sure we know what we have before we list it on eBay, especially these games. Uh, I need to go through all those, look those up, but uh, all in all, I think it was a great morning at the flea market. I believe we spent $177 total. Uh, and if I had to give you a rough estimate um, without looking up any of those games, I, I, we probably have, I don't know, around $450 to $500, $550 uh, in profit after all fees and everything are accounted for. So again, not a bad morning at the flea market. I totally forgot to show you guys these two items. So this is a Pentax IQ Zoom 105S point and shoot camera. I need to get a battery for it, make sure it works, but these usually hold up pretty well. It's probably gonna work just fine. Sole comps on this, well, there's one listed for 49 free shipping, another one listed for 29 plus shipping. Uh, so two listed, let's see solds here. Four sold, so 200% uh, sell through rate. Uh, 40 bucks plus shipping on that one, 20 bucks on auction, 30 bucks. So I think we paid $5 for this. Uh, so as long as it works, um, maybe I can find a case for it or something like that. Maybe get 30, 35 bucks plus shipping. And finally, we have this really cool Harry Potter Universal Studios wand. This is the Mad Eye Moody wand. I cannot find soul comps on this. I imagine when it was at Universal Studios, it was probably. I don't know, 30, 40 bucks or so. Everything there's pretty expensive, but in used condition, not at Universal Studios, I imagine we can maybe get like, I don't know, 20, 25 bucks for this, uh, but we'll see. So it's a couple days into the future and I've actually already sold some of the stuff that we picked up at the flea market. First thing going out is this Craig uh, voice recorder. We sold that for $36 free shipping. Uh, this went in a padded flat rate envelope for $8. So uh, not making a ton of money on that, but it moved really fast. I think it sold in less than 24 hours. We also sold one of these fig pin things that we picked up. I still have no idea what this thing is, but it sold $32.99 free shipping. It went to an international buyer. Uh, but it went through the eBay global shipping program. So we only had to pay like, I think five bucks to, to ship it out. So not too bad. And that's gonna do it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. You're the best and we'll catch you on the next one. <laughs>